New this morning, it has been less than six months since Justin Fuente was announced the new head coach at Virginia Tech. You know, when you change jobs in this business, there's no two weeks notice. You know, you, you just pick up and go and start working. Now he and his family are getting adjusted to life in their new hometown of Blacksburg. In an exclusive interview, WSLS 10's Aaron Brookshire sits down with the coach and his wife to talk about the whirlwind of excitement they're experiencing. Aaron, good morning. Good morning. Yeah, after coaching his final game in Memphis, Coach Fuente and his wife Jenny decided it was time to tell their three daughters the big news, that they'd be moving to Blacksburg. So they decided to use Virginia Tech's well-known entrance tradition. Using Inner Sandman to get the girls excited for their new home. Justin brought out the, the iPad and we showed him the entrance, Inter Sandman in the stadium. And um, we said, Justin said, now isn't that cool? And our oldest, yeah, 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 that's really cool. And Justin said, well, that's going to be our new team. That's our new team. And she was really excited. Now, so far, they tell me they've heard the song played at other sporting events, but haven't felt the full impact of 66,000 fans jumping in Lane Stadium. Jenny tells me she and the girls were on their way to football practice recently when they heard the Virginia Tech anthem playing at the softball field. As we were leaving, they were playing it, and we could hear the people stomping their feet on the bleachers, and I immediately got goosebumps and said to my girls, we had another coach's daughter with us, can you guys believe that? They're going to play that in the fall. I feel like everybody in Blacksburg's been to the game except for us. So we're looking forward to, to being a part of all that, too. And they'll get their first real taste of the massive Virginia Tech fan base tomorrow when the spring game kicks off at 2.30 in Blacksburg.